could be a summer of savings in Massachusetts. Shoppers are excited about the idea of a two-month-long tax holiday. The governor proposed making August and September tax-free. But as WBZ's Tiffany Chan shows us, leaders in some cities and towns argue that tax money should be used to meet some critical needs. You'll see this almost the whole length of the road. Miles of bumpy, unpaved roadways in Attleboro, but not enough state funding to fix it. That's why the city's public works superintendent, Michael Tyler, says the state cannot afford to forego the sales tax for two whole months, $900 million in revenue, according to the governor. It's probably one of the number one complaints any municipality receives is about their roadways not being sufficient. It's a quality of life issue. We should almost be receiving almost four times what we receive. Superintendent Tyler says that's $900 million that would be better spent. But shoppers tell us otherwise. I think it's great. It's great to keep money in people's pockets. The government already has a budget. If they get the money, they'll just find a way to spend it. Governor Charlie Baker's proposal would waive the 6% sales tax on most items for the entire months of August and September to help businesses hit hardest by the pandemic. Along Davis Square in Somerville, some shoppers tell us they'll reap the benefits too. The amount of savings that it will bring and how it would encourage the community to actually go out there and spend. While town officials say what the community really needs is more funding for safer roadways. This road, as uh, I mentioned to you, has not been resurfaced for, I believe, almost 25 years. Our roads need attention now. The infrastructure is, uh, I say, it's something that everybody uses. Uh, I think it's a great investment of money. In Attleboro, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.